Crawford, set to fight the Warrior. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight battle. The problem is nine years his elder. The Warrior is five inches taller. He will have a five inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Oslo, Norway, the Warrior. And now we're going to see his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, the Clown. All right, greet the rules in the locker room. I want you to be with your hands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fight. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is going to go down fight, right go. now. Oh, and he goes up top of the kick. Tonight's main event of the evening is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Nice shot. He scores with a nasty inside leg kick. Very slow and methodical. And he is mixing it up nicely. He blocks that vicious knee. Can't connect with the jab. Good nice. inside leg kick. That's a big hook. Oh, head kick. And another head kick lands. His opponent needs to defend. Good kick with the left by the Warrior. He's back up again. Under two. Flying knee attempt. Back and forth. Looking to shoot. Fainting with the punch. Front kick to the face. He tags him with the hook. Huge leg kick. Nice block, and he counters with the jab. Landed a couple good shots here. The problem gets him in the flop. Under a minute now on the clock here in this round. And they're free. The Warrior with the jab that scores. Yeah, he's got a nice snap to that leg kick. Very nice. Man, he gets some torque on that hook. That's a big takedown late in the round. 15 seconds. The problem gets back up again. 
nasty leg kick. Nice leg kicks. And again, he catches him. Into the round. Right. And that was a huge takedown that will score points. Here's a perfect head kick. Here's a perfectly placed knee that does some real damage. And here's a flying knee with excellent timing. Very exciting round. And the lovely Brittany. You ready? You ready? Second round. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's going to look to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. Wow! Trying to stay out of trouble here. That's Huge a hard hook. hook. Swing and a miss. Big shots. Strong jab. He is going after it here. Man, that leg kick will do some damage. Oh, Joe, another strong jab. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Failed attempt. Head kick. Nicely done. Hard hook. Nicely done. He slipped the punch. And they clinch. Good job blocking the shot to the body. He advances with double underhooks. The amount of damage that has been done to his body makes you wonder if he's got a broken rib or two. The Warriors, they nice caught him with the knee! Big knee. Wow! That's a damaging knee to the body. Hard straight punch. Back and forth battle. Excellent head movement. Man, he was looking for the knockout there. Damaging left, left hand. Hard jab. Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. They have fought for ten minutes. That's the end of round number two. An excellent round and a big knockdown from the Warrior. There was a huge moment in that round and a huge moment in this fight. Here's a powerful knee that lands and causes the knockdown. Let's look at that again from another angle. And let's look at that from another camera angle. The lovely Carly, tonight in London, England. Swinging. Nice knee to the body. The huge head kick is blocked. Nice oh. inside leg kick. Nice. 
laid on his feet. Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising on his right side. Here we see the striking accuracy for the Warrior, landing 53% of his significant strikes. The Warrior with a good knee to the body. They are exchanging here, Mike. Big roundhouse kick. He timed that perfectly. Missed that shot. Oh, that's a vicious knee to the body. Great head kick. Three minutes. The Warrior with the lead left. Single. In the full guard here. The problem with a nice punch from the bottom. Back to his feet. Vicious flying, flying, flying knee. The problem got tagged by that right. Good defense with the parry. Clean knee to the body lands. Nice knee. He blocks that huge knee. Man, those body shots have been lethal. Look at the bruising on his right side. Oh, he wraps him! Nice takedown! Oh! The problem's unable to pass. Transitions to full mount. He hip escapes from the full mount. Back to the guard position. He got his hips well enough to get back to half guard. That's a big elbow, Joe. Huge elbow. Oh, he connected with an elbow. That's the end of round three. The problem's gonna be looking to bounce back here in this round. That was not good. He got knocked down again and badly hurt. This is not going his way. Let's see that again from another angle. And here we see that again. Charlie getting a set for round four. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Round fight. four underway. Nice leg kick. Great jab by the Warrior. Inside leg kick lands. The problem with the left. Man, he has really worked the midsection well, and you can see the bruising on the left side of his body. Timing his strikes nicely. And again, he connects with the kick. Let's take a look at the striking accuracy for the Warrior, landing 52% of his strikes. Nice parry there. Great job defending that double. Nice inside leg kick. Man, beautiful front kick. Nice roundhouse kick to the body. Strong knee to the body by the Warrior. Big takedown. Let's see what he can do from here. He hip escapes, he's out of the full mount. The problem with good connection from the bottom. 
into the full guard. The Warrior goes into side control. And he got back to guard. Hammer fist. Good move back into half guard. He's moved to full guard. Trying to take the back here. He's got his back. I need you to get control of his wrist. Looking for the arm bar, looking for the finish. Wants to get that leg across his opponent's face. Almost had the arm bar. The Warrior with the hammer fist. Manny really timed that sweep. He's in half guard. Joe, you can see the effects of the damage that he's taken tonight. His face is a mess. That connected. Back up. Nice knee to the body. Right, right for the books. We are headed to the fifth and final round. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Carly getting set for the fifth and final round. Last round, guys. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Five fight. minutes remains in the fight. Nice inside leg. Man, he connects with the right and the left. Oh, and he ate a front kick. The problem counters with the right jab. Back nice. and forth. There's the jab. Man, he's thrown some heavy body shots, and you can see the bruising on his right side. There you see the total strikes landed so far in our fight. Showing the punch. That's a nice feint. Quick slip of the left. Good body shot with the knee. He's got the clinch. Oh, he's worked himself to double underhooks. He missed on that jab. Nice knee by the Warrior. Connected there. Solid leg kick by the Warrior. Postured up. In half guard now. The problem's clearly behind on the judges' scorecards. He needs to look to do something dynamic immediately. He needs to get a submission. He needs to figure out how to get himself into a dominant position and finish this fight. Oh, very bad. Full mount. Half guard. Tags him. The problem gets it back into his guard. Now he's going for a Kimura. He throws his arm through, slides it under. He's got the arm locked in. He's got it in position. This is very tight. He's that Kimura looks nasty, and he's free. And he's on top. Half guard. Man, that cut on his eyebrow is looking nasty. It just continues to get worse. Oh, he's got, oh, his, he's got his back. He's got him flat now on his back. And the mount again. The 
Warriors got in the back again. From uh, from a flattening out position, when you got a guy face down, you can really hurt him with that position. Just gonna step right back over. Back to the mount again. He's working from his back again. This Great one fight. goes the distance. What a battle. The Warriors' ultra-aggressive striking attack led to multiple knockdowns and should make the decision of the judges very easy. Absolutely. The aggression, the multiple knockdowns, significant strikes landed, all of those things spell out a clear victory. Round three, the legs buckle, and he's down. Round four, looks good, in perfect position, attacks with the technique, but loses it. Round five, here we see the punch turn in, and boom, find its way home. Bruce Buffer Ladies and gentlemen, has gathered the judges' scorecards. Rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 49-46, 48-47, and 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, the Warrior. The Warrior, victorious by unanimous decision.